Washington, who braced herself, got a good grip as she grabbed that ball, that toss from Martinez in the air with a fair hand and made the throw. Nice play by Texas. One out to get another pinch hitter, Bailey Goddard steps in. This is the last chance for Florida Gators. Like one of my favorite teams. Smooth, smooth Looks like they didn't score nothing the at all. Today. Mm. Again, the team we're rooting for for tonight's game is is Texas Longhorns, and that's Bailey Goddard Senior from Orange Park, Florida. One of my favorite players from the University of Florida softball team. Sometimes, though, when you're playing really well, you just want to get back out and play again. Instead of having those days off. Ground ball to third. Mia Scott. Will that do it? Yes, it will. We won the game. We won the game. With a 10-1 demolition of Florida. And our score is 10 to nothing. Go Texas Longhorns. We are moving on to the semifinals. We did it. I mean, what a statement by Texas to make their presence known here at the World Series. Florida is a very good team. We saw what Keegan Rothrock did just a couple of nights ago with how she threw in the circle, being able to get that shutout, but Texas said not to. It looks like Florida will face against Alabama tomorrow at 3 o'clock p.m. on ESPN on, a on ABC. And also tomorrow, UCLA will face against Stanford tomorrow at 7 p.m. on ESPN2. And then Oklahoma will wait a winner for, you know, and that goes for our team as well. And ours will be up on, on ESPN2 for Monday. Two teams in the country, Oklahoma and Texas, onto the semis. The defending three-time national champions in the Sooners. And the Longhorns who met them in the Champ Series two years ago. Fueled tonight by Matt Gordon. By her, she set the tone in the circle, and this is what you have to have in the World Series somebody who comes out right away from the first inning to set the tone for your team. Everything about this game starts in the circle. And that's Mac Morgan Jr., one of my favorite players. The first time Texas has started the World Series with back to back. We have some fans here from the University of Florida and the University of, 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 ten, oh, sorry, of Texas. Yes, the University of Texas at Austin. Now she's now with... It's well, Mac that's Morgan, uh, there's one of my favorite players. Wow, that sounds We've good. So she like ate that for breakfast sometimes in the morning. Super oh, that's regionals. nice. How did that prepare you and this team to come in here and fight the way that you have so far? Uh, Super Regionals, every game was a fight, so we knew it was when we had our backs against the uh, backs against the wall, and then we know it's going to be the same thing here. I mean, you lose two, you're done, and like, and you, if you lose one, you're in a hard bracket to get to this top. So we're just fighting, our, fighting for our lives now, and you know, generally just having fun, getting our seniors here to, to end their careers here. It's such amazing, and every, everyone wanted that for them. So I think we're all leaning on each other, and you're ready for this. What does a day off in Oklahoma City look like for this team? We still have practice. We go practice. We had practice this morning. We were always better in the game and like wanting to better ourselves and being prepared. Matt, congratulations on the win. Thank you. And we'll be right back here on Monday on ESPN2. And Mike White said he wanted his team to have the wow moment when they got here. So that's okay. 
have the wow moment and then settle in. They've had a lot of wow moments in these two games. A 14-0 combined margin of victory over Stanford and Florida. Texas will play in the semifinals on Monday night. They'll face either Stanford or UCLA there. Coming up after the break, we'll get you to squeeze play, go around the nation for the men's NCAA tournament. That does us for tonight, day three at the Women's College World Series. For Alyssa Lang and Amanda Scarborough, Kevin Brown, so long from OKC. What a game, what a day, what a performance.